Dear you. Yes, you. You're amazing. Don't argue with me. Don't dispute it. It's a fact. You may be mentally rattling off all the reasons why you're not amazing right now, but for every one you can come up with, I have something to say about it. So you might as well just sit and listen for a minute. You might as well let your mind rest, especially if it's been in self-hate mode for a while. If you're on your way to self-love, fantastic. I'm proud of you. If you've already found self-love, wonderful. It's great, isn't it? If you're still fighting your way to self-love, skeptical of whether or not that concept can ever exist for you, keep fighting. It's worth it. I promise. But back to the ways in which you are amazing. You are here. That may seem like a silly, simplistic answer you don't think makes you amazing at all, but it does. Think about all the things you've faced in your life so far. Think about all the journeys, the hardships, the struggles, the pain. Then give yourself some credit for surviving it all. I bet it wasn't easy, yet here you are. So that's pretty amazing. Celebrate that. It's Awareness Week, and I'm aware of you. Yes, you. You've made it this far. You're fighting. That's amazing. Or you've fought your way through and are doing well. That's amazing. Are you condemning yourself right now? Are you disappointed? Are you saying it's no big deal? Stop that way of thinking. Stop arguing with these words. In a nutshell, all I'm saying is you are here, and that's cool. So why put energy into discrediting that? Your energy can be better served elsewhere. Trust me. And you are so worth it. If anything is worth that energy, you are. Yes, you. So don't break yourself down. Don't sell yourself short. Don't give up on yourself. Celebrate you. Yes, you. I'm going to celebrate you. You can join me or not. It's your choice. But I'm going to celebrate you. And you are invited. If I'm going to celebrate you, you should really be there, don't you think? So come on, celebrate you. Yes, you.